Hello everybody, I am Brandman19 and welcome to episode 14 of our United States of Earth campaign in Supreme Lore 2020. We have pretty much, uh, we have two large scale wars going on and technically this is very, this is more of the large scale um, because we're fighting Venezuela, Ecuador, and Peru. But uh, at the same time, we, our African colony is having to fight off against Mauritania, Mali, uh, and Cote d'Ivoire. But the problem with this is that we don't have a whole heck of a lot of units over here. So they're fighting three opponents who may be a little weaker than Venezuela and the rest of them, but they're having to do it with much less. So it's a challenge still. Which is, that's fine, I want challenges. These guys are gonna... Let's try to get here. If I can take that, this area might be easier for them to hold off on. These guys are gonna have to take out Buafo. There's Gagnoa. I'm not gonna worry about that just right now. I need to, I really need to focus on this side. We are fight, trying to fight our way into the Caracas area, which we've kind of gotten close. There they go, all their men running off. Let's take that. Let's try to rush in here and knock out this guy too. I'm trying to do a whole heck of a lot right now. It's not easy to keep that going. These guys are fighting a defensive war. I think we've actually lost some. Or no, we've actually... I think we've held. Did a pretty good job holding it, I guess. Oh, this is a nothing out here. I don't know why I've got tanks there. Send uh, more guys over here. We've got to get into Caracas and we've got to take the whole area over. Not easy. Come on, men. Keep working. Okay, push through here. Get these guys going back. And we just gotta knock out these units here. We got plenty of units to do that. At least I think we do. Let's look over here. Um, partisan unit formed right where we were sitting. That area is hold, held all right. I don't have to worry about anything with it. Um, let's go ahead and repair. Wait, why can't you repair here? It'd be nicer if you could repair there. This is going to be in my little... They can't afford... Like I can to put a hydro facility there. So if I put one there and it's like to cost them too much, it's going to tank their economy more. So it's kind of like my little way of like, if you do manage to start taking me out, and I can't do anything about it, you take over that land there and uh, it hurts your economy. Which I was playing multiplayer, I would do that. Which I played some multiplayer, and uh, it's not really designed for that. But uh, in multiplayer games, I've done that before, and, and players don't realize the mistake they've made until after they've taken it. And I'm pretty, I'm always very sure not to jump out and do anything and take that spot back until I know that they're hurting really bad. Oh my! Took their capital. Oh goodness! Okay. Oh, that was Brazil. Okay. Um, these guys need to repair. 
Let's look out over here. Um, build, transport, road. Okay. Took all this. Might take us a little bit to get everything rebuilt. Big thing to worry about is this right here. Where are we going to walk this across at? Ocean, ocean, light forest, ocean, river narrow. Yeah, right here. So we'll build there. Then it's light forest. We're just going to crawl on across. So it's not that bad. Okay, um, these guys are all repairing, that's okay. We're not even gonna try to, we're not even really gonna worry about Brazil so much. our little snaky path on down here. Build transport road. It's still jungle. That's a river narrow, so we'll probably come out need reinforcements. like that across there. Alright guys, let's let's not get into a, a, a huge jungle war here. I don't want to do that. It's really not worth it. Let's file on the periphery and then let's get on in here. Who in the world is that? Oh, it's the Netherlands! <laughs> they don't... I guess they consider us touching here, so they're like, oh, we're not going to have this with you. That's okay, buddy. Who, are th who is Russia at war with right now? Still China, Iran, and Poland, and they've almost destroyed Poland. Poland's gone all the way down to Krakow now. Uh, let's send... Those guys here and there. Try to get ourselves a little bit of a little bit of breathing room uh, down here. Let's try to send them here, right next to the capital. Right next to the capital. Right next to the capital, and right down here next to the capital. We're just trying to. If we can take over some nice little land fabrication in the capital here, then they're not going to press any further, I don't believe. We need reinforcements. Trench and hold. Ooh, a lot of guys are hurt. Yeah, they're going to have to fall back. I may even have to start looking at bringing units over. see what we can do about this first. Um, look at how many units are just kind of filtering down here in the jungle like that's gonna matter. There's no supply here, it doesn't matter. I'm not gonna mount an expedition down here into Brazil either. At least not a big one. We need reinforcements. see this. Okay, M2A4 Bradleys. Let's get rid of them. They can stay right where they are. FCSW. Okay, low sats can stay. Of course, artillery can stay. 
Oh, I grabbed even aircraft. Crap. And ships. No, that was too many. Okay. Um, go to Warner Robins. Tech level went up. Let's go ahead and throw that together. Uh, naval launched harpoons. Uh, let's see. Oh, the Molnar. Yes. M1080 FCS. Artillery. Perfect. We have a whole bunch of uh, units now. Let's take these 10 C5 galaxies to Warner Robins. We'll put as many guys as we can on here and get them over to Africa. Things that, things over here will work themselves out. I'm not worried about it. Yeah, I could worry about it, but I'm just not going need to. Reinforcements. Yeah, see, some of this is just dumb. Like, why are you here? Of all places, why there? Where's the... There you go. go. Go work this area over here and get these guys where they need to be. I mean, at least let's try to get... Let's take Sal Gabriel. That will make it easier. Actually, let's repair him there. See, this guy, there, it's already got a... Fa it's already fast. It's already ready to go. Let me move him down here. Let's try this. He can't travel across water, can he? Nope, oh, that wasn't cool. Yep, they're already working down here. I think they all kind of realize that's where the bigger threat is that they can get at. lay this in and it doesn't really matter who owns the land I mean they could own the land we could own the land somebody though will be pay will be trying to get the road working is this the actual yep that's the river okay Build transport road. Oh, that's a river too. I should have brought him over one more. That's okay. We will figure it out. See, now he can build that for me. I don't care if he, he can spend the money on that. All right, here we go. Um... Load into him. Wish this was easier. Load into him. See, I'm just having to pick one at a time. There and let's grab this guy. Load into we need there. All of you are here now. Cross the 
way we will go. To there. Please don't cross over their territory near a jet. That's all I gotta say now. Let's try to do the same thing through here. We can maybe try to get more of it done. It'll transport. Supply way better. See, that's already been built. It's going to take a while to get over these. Yeah, 77 days. 76. 76. 80. That's got 86 days, yeah. Better off just to work our way around them, too. You know, at the same time. Here these guys come. We need reinforcements. All of you. Back up here to Warner Robins. You're going to pick up my second load. All of you are going here. All of you are going there. Let's try to take their capital if we can. Oh yeah, here we go. They're all stacking up in there now. We need reinforcements. Go ahead and take everything behind you too. Yep, going after these guys. They're gonna work back and fight them. Yep, going after the M113. Good lord, they are gonna run them over now. Come on, men, work down here. Let's go ahead and knock out Gagnoa take out him here and then we'll work on this guy yep Gagno is falling quick too well, let's go here right in between them both of them They can, they'll find whoever they want to focus on. Well, if the supply would have been there, yes. Reinforcements. Let's look down here. Um, take that. We're back to working on this again. So, Gabriel... Let me grab everything I have here that can get in the water. We need reinforcements. Yeah, the Timberwolves can't do it. The Bradleys can. I got 25 units, and we'll throw them all right back here they can make it they can make it if they can't they can't we'll see eventually they'll make it though I think send these guys south Lots of tanks up here. Get these guys over here. So we'll have another group over here try to take the road as best as they can. Q 
Okay. Keep on coming. Up, hold out. Don't worry about that guy. What is that? I think it's an A4. Yep, A4 Skyhawk. That's what the that's what the uh, Brazilian Navy uses. But they're really old. They actually use them on their aircraft carrier, which a lot of people don't know. The Brazilians have an aircraft carrier. They're one of the few nations that is not NATO, Russia, or China that has actual aircraft carriers. Um, matter of fact, I think the nations are the United States, the UK, France, Spain. Yeah, so one, two, three, four. Um, Italy, I think. And that's five. Russia's six. Um, India is seven. China is eight. And then Brazil makes nine, and then there's one more that you wouldn't even think of, and that's Thai that's uh Thailand has one. But they call it more of the it only ever goes out when uh the king is on board, like once a year. And they they're like, Yeah, it's pretty much a a big gigantic expensive yacht for the king of Thailand. So it used to be I think like a British carrier or something, I'm not sure. They're wanting to fight in this weird region for whatever reason. I say forego that. We'll, we'll go elsewhere. Oh, that's FCSW. That's fine. Uh, let's send all these guys down to here. Now these guys are going to work on that. He's just stopped. Hovering and stopped. I'm not even... I don't even know. I'm just going to move out of the way and look somewhere else. <laughs> Act like I don't see that and have to start asking questions. What the world is going on? Uh, we are under attack by who now? Really? G Guyana? <laughs> okay. If, if that's what they want, man, that's what they can get. We need reinforcements. Let's see, I want to move across here. I want to make sure we get all this stuff done. Yeah, I, I figured we were going to lose a little bit. Come on, little, little, everybody a little bit further. Just get across. <laughs> if I can take that, that might spur some supply up and down this area. That's why I'm trying to do it. Not to mention I can guarantee that that bridge will get done. And I can watch it get done. And I can also start working on a road out here. Well, down here, but still. Alright, we'll wait. I do not like this whatsoever. Oh, they have enough there. Yeah. I have to get here to be able to take on Guyana, so I'm not really... Uh not really going to go do some weird stuff for that. Knock him out. There you go. I'll tell you, this is a weird war over here. I'm not used to having to fight this long and this hard for really nothing. At least not as not with the United States or something. You know, with the United States, I expect just to kind of run the table, but it's not happening over here. It's not really happening over here either. 
Though we are making some good progress in different directions. Let's go ahead and try to do this. Go. Get in there. Okay, you're you're fighting without help. Come come back down here and help him. Okay, we'll take out Sal Gabriel. Okay, he's running. One more after this. We need reinforcements. Wonderful, there we go. Build a transport road. Come here. And then also, of course, we're going south right after that. Could have just gone south of that river, couldn't I? But nope, can't be easy. And we're gonna let this kind of build up, get that airfield back to work in. Very important that I do that. Then we'll cross down here and we'll make a we'll just make a line going to where I'm trying to go. Be wonderful though when I don't have to do have to deal with all this Amazon area. We've taken this and all that as well, and all that's working. Be nice to not have to worry about this again. How long is it going to take that airfield? By the way, it's at 92 percent right now. Just went to 93. We need reinforcements. Oh yeah, these guys are working these guys out right now. Entrench. Entrench. Oh, it won't take us long once we get this going. No, it won't take me long at all. Want all these Bradleys though for a reason. They're gonna build. They're gonna help me build my road out here, and I need them. And I need them and their abilities to get me my supply. It's just gonna go. All the way out to here. Cut to there. 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 Not it, it's not super complicated or anything. Definitely want to get these bridges started though. Bridges are what hold back supply so much. Like, bridges and the need for, you know, our rivers hold back supply the most. Which makes sense. 100, you know, 100%. 65 days, 58 days. I'm not getting any supply here. Go ahead and entrench. We'll go as far as supply wants to take us. There it goes. Let's go ahead and build transport road. You can go ahead and start on all that. there we go. But alright guys, I think I'm going to end this one right here. Still at war with those three. Um, my little airdrop didn't really seem to work. This seems like maybe we have put more men over here, but they're all really badly hurt. So we're going to let them uh, repair up on this side. Over here, we're so focused on getting this one road in that I'm not, I'm not going to go too crazy with it. Uh, we're just going to keep pushing down here. Get our road, you know, at least in place. And then we'll uh, come back and start focusing on this stuff again. 
just to get it going. But all right, guys, appreciate y'all so much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment, and I'll see you guys next time.